Hello Fast Bikes, we're here with Bike Channel at Brands Hatch, glorious day. We're here to test the BMW S1000RR, uh, 2010 Fast Bike Sports Bike of the Year. Um, need we say more, 180, 180 horsepower at the rear wheel standard, bog standard, 180 kilos, uh, fastest in most at the moment. Race, isn't it? White boy in his GTR. Look who it is, Craig Curry. Hi, you're right. How you doing, mate? Not bad. Good, thank you. So you want to race then? Yeah, I think um, I'm ready for a race. I'll, uh, what's that? This is a BMW S1000 Double R. It's only got half the wheels I've got. Yeah, it's got half the power. 180 horsepower, 180 kilos, 12 and a half grand, mate. Let's talk spec for yours then. 60 grand. <sighs> Safer. A lot of car. Best car on the road for 60 grand. 470 brake horsepower, not 63 and a half seconds. But it's a right bus, isn't it? How much is that weigh? 1.8 tonnes. It's not a bus. It's fast. It's stable. It brakes. It corners. Best car on the road. Let's go driving. Ciao. No. You bikers, moped riders, taking all the boom boom all this all over the road. Not happening this time. Close, but I think the car. There's a lot of curves here, so the bike's going to be leaning over and he's not going to be able to get on the power so easy. Uh, I'm going to go with the car. Definitely the car. The bike. Why? Um, it'll have a quick speed on the top straight, bottom straight. Initial thoughts? I'm going to try and waste him.
I come to the end of the day, um, well, it's been pretty close. I must admit, when they rolled it out uh, and Craig went out there initially, and he was doing 53 straight away, I thought, this is going to be tricky. Initially, we were going to use the whole GP circuit, and I was confident the bike down the straights and the sweeping corners would have the edge, um, particularly with BMW's traction control. Um, but as it is, we end up using the Indy circuit, and although there's not a lot of straights, the bike did edge it uh, by quite a bit. Thanks to its lightness, thanks to 180 horsepower, uh, and she's a big old girl, uh, 1.8 tons. But you know, 430 horsepower. Again, it was going to be close. In the end, the, the bike did a 52.1, and the car did a 53.7. So it's 1.6 seconds. Not a lot, really, when you consider it. Yeah. So obviously, the biggest, um, the biggest advantage for the car was on the brakes. I mean, it absolutely murdered me on the brakes. Uh, she's a big old girl, but she's got four wheels, massive Brembo calipers. Um, and yeah, particularly going into the hairpin to, uh, to Druids, the amount of, I mean, it probably 20, 30 meters that caught up with me. Exit of the corners, I thought the Nissan would edge it, to be honest with you, and then obviously the bike would, would, uh, would carry a bit more speed, but BMW's got a traction control system, the light was permanently on, um, and she truly delivered. But at the end of the day, I had no choice. I had to beat the car or I wouldn't be going to that office, trust me. All that's to me to say is a big thank you to Bike Channel. Thanks for coming out and uh, helping us. Obviously a big thank you to Nissan for the, uh, the, the loan of the car. And a massive thank you to Craig Curry, um, who obviously is driving all day um, and sliding and leaving big darkies through, uh, throughout Brown's Hatch.